Okay, and also, before I forget, I need to go get a magic upgrade. <laughs> yeah, yeah, please do that. Uh, I'm trying to chain rolls and be all fancy. Why is the music giving me Stardew Valley vibes? Yeah. <laughs> well, this is this is clearly the Thorntail Hollow theme. Wow. <laughs> Yay. Isn't it great that you get that upgrade and it doesn't just automatically fill your magic and instead you have to go and collect all these? They clearly like, they clearly could have done it because they left the they left them there. They knew this was a problem. Exactly. Yeah, no, it's it's like they made every aspect of this game as tedious as possible. Yep. It's true. That is absolutely how it feels. <laughs> like, at some point, there was a meeting, a bunch of people sitting around, somebody's got a marker and whiteboard, and they're just like, how can we waste the, the player's time as much as possible? Okay, but, so, you joke, but that was kind of how they were marketing video games back then, is like, this game is over 40 hours of content! Oh yeah, no, for sure. <laughs> Which is why now when I see a game that's like, it has, you know, 80 hours of content, I'm like, why are you threatening me? <laughs> Hard pass. Yeah, I do. Oh, if your game's right. longer than three hours, I'm not interested. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I was hoping you would talk. Okay. Well, why? Right, let's go to... Are you ready <laughs> no! to go to Palace? I guess... He doesn't squish you like he does when he sends you to Ice Mountain. I thought he was going to swallow you. <laughs> <laughs> no, we already did the Vor boss. We already did that one. Okay. Like, this game's only going to have one. It only has one. That's sure. some amazing restraint. Yeah, right? So this is Krasoa Palace. Okay, Tricky. Let's find out where we can release the spirit. Tricky? Tricky! Oh, God bless. Uh, uh, sorry. I forgot to tell you. I cannot warp dinosaurs. Then what is your purpose of being on a dinosaur planet? Then what fucking good are you, dude? <laughs> Who made you? <laughs> I can't warp dinosaurs, but I live on dinosaur planet and I'm anchored to the ground here. Is this some kind of punishment for a crime? <laughs> <laughs> You'll be imprisoned on Dinosaur Planet until you manage to teleport 400 people. <laughs> but no dinosaurs, that's cheating. Right, no, I'm sorry, you can only teleport furries, no scalies here. Mm. Combat again? I, I just did the test of combat. You don't need to try and test me with combat anymore. I'm very good at this video game. That's a lie. I'm gonna screw up this next section a couple of times. I feel it in my bones. <laughs> oh, anyway, so this whole section sucks uh, because it's all dark, and the only thing you can where is my fucking the only thing you can do is use the lantern. Oh, nasty. Yeah, that's oh. right. Let's see. I like how, how it go. trails behind you. I know, just like a just like how a lantern would. Mm -hmm. Right. Okay. I believe I remember the way. 
So the reason uh, I went to go check that out first is because we have to carry a timed barrel the whole way with us. Oh, good. Love it. It's fucked up that your purple eyes don't give you night vision like you're some kind of chronicle of Riddick. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that'd be so cool, though. Rare, hire this man. Right? I'm full of amazing <laughs> ideas. I cannot believe my lantern ran out. I can't believe I didn't fuck that up. Wow. Good job. <laughs> Crushing it. First try. Easy every time. Easy every time. So, do those turn off? No. But they move. <laughs> this one's just mean. This is one where I just can't. I know. It's actually not that bad. Uh, you just have to be careful. Yeah, see? See? Alright. Oh, yeah, right. How do I deal with this thing? Oh, oh, I see. Well, I'll do the puzzle first. I'll miss the puzzle first. didn't count. Fuck you. <laughs> why was the why was this thing shield tied to like lights? Oh, that's right. I have to go get the barrel again. <laughs> oh no. boy. Oh jeez. Uh-huh. Oh. Game design. Oh, there's dudes in here. I don't feel like dealing with dudes. Goodbye, dudes. No, let me teleport. <laughs> <laughs> no, it won't let me teleport. There's dudes. There is no teleporting. There is only dudes. I I don't I can't get the context button because every time I hit A, it just makes Fox pull his staff out to whip ass. I I probably could just skip them and just load this up. <laughs> is that good? What just happened? Okay, all right, it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so here's uh, the inside of the Krizoa Palace. Mm hmm. It's big. And I'm going to injure Fox real quick because I want to point something out. God. Doesn't this wall look a little bit familiar? Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, so that's where she got shot out of. Oh, anyway, what do I do here? This way. Uh, excuse you. <laughs> There's really not a lot that knocks you back, huh? No, there is nothing that knocks you back. You just get hit, and Fox is like, okay. And he keeps going. Also, of course, that, that other wind tunnel wasn't the one I have to take. This one is the one I have to take, clearly. Sure, yeah. Oh, so hey, we're on we're on top of uh, Krizoa Palace. Oh, look, who is that? Jesus oh god, Christ. the saxophone! Please! 
<laughs> You're killing me. Uh, does that subtitle want to go away? No. No. <laughs> what am I doing? Get me here. What are you doing, Fox? Release the spirit and get out of there. Peppy out. Okay, okay, I'm going. I can't just release the spirit and leave. I need a little romance. <laughs> Sorry, Peppy, I'm horny. Fox McCloud <laughs> internally signing up for Fur Affinity. Now that's brass that's just a single note. It's amazing. <laughs> now that's what I call Vor. Oh uh, god. Volume 2. Right there, Fox. Time for you to head down to the seaside. Check the signposts for directions. Okay, big fella. Am I going on vacation? Your job and helping out. You cheeky little blighter. <laughs> now, I've been keeping this back for you. Ready for when you needed it. Thanks, Mom. A sack. Thank you. <laughs> it's a slightly larger wallet. Oh my god, everyone wants to talk to Fox. Hope that helps you, Fox. Thanks. Hi, Thanks, Fox. Slippy. I already know we need to go to the beach. Alright. <laughs> yeah, like a beach game. episode! <laughs> <laughs> Finally, Fox in a swimsuit. Ah, damn it. Hold on, I'm gonna give it another shot. I think I actually need something from the shop to do that. Maybe. I say maybe as if I have any fucking clue. <laughs> Anything's possible if you can imagine it. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, sounds plausible to me. An yes, expert quite. in video games. Well, speaking of the shop, we haven't been in there in a little while, so... But you know why ruin a good thing? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna go get some binoculars, you know, and maybe like one map. Where's the binoculars? Me, every time I pick up my order at Popeyes, just throwing my arms in the air triumphantly. Okay, I'll sell it to you. My phone speaker just blasting some, you know, triumphant little ditty from Kevin McLeod. <laughs> Alright, so I did need to get that map. Uh, the binoculars are just extra. So, are you all ready to go to the beach? Let's go to the beach. It is summertime, after all. Let's, let's go to the beach. 
Hopefully we'll all get paid after the tournament. No? Um, Nothing? Um... <laughs> Link's you're the only one I would expect to even understand. Remember uh, that old Triforce tried to get everybody to the beach? Yeah, no, I do. <laughs> I do. This is a, this oh, is a fighting I... games thing. Ah. <laughs> ah. Yeah. God. You know, I, I should also make sure I'm going the right way. I had Fox. not thought about Triforce in years. Check the detail readout, Fox. <laughs> I have a I folder of uh, music on my computer that is just uh, quotes from that video uh, where he's like, "All right, Sam, for Choma Empire combo." <laughs> God, I have that on my computer. So, so for those that don't know, Triforce was for a long time. <laughs> Kind of a an infamous figure in the fighting game scene. Um, he was one of the first people that did the whole idea of like, you know, a fighting game team. That like, you know, now there's you know sponsored teams and stuff everywhere. But he, as far as fighting games go, he was kind of one of the first, and uh, that's maybe the most positive thing I can say about him. <laughs> I see. Yeah, not a lot of good words uh, for Triforce. No. To be uh, man tried to scam a lot of people. Okay, uh -huh. that was my that was gonna be my next question. Is uh, is he more of a, a turf bad person or a crypto bad person? And it sounds like the answer is crypto. Oh, for no, all I know, it could be both. Well. <laughs> That's true. I guess I guess we can't rule it out. We're talking old names in the FGC. It could be both. <laughs> Oh, I don't want to think about the Triforce NFT. <laughs> oh, I did the wrong thing. You know, there's never been a better time. Now, now that crypto is collapsing. <laughs> All right, so I need to get money. Well, have you heard of these NFTs? <laughs> No. <laughs> All my Krizoa no. spirits gone. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Oh, but yeah, no, this guy needs 60 scarabs. What a voice. I oh, I know it's so good. I need to pay him 60 scarabs to enter Cape Claw and I only have 46. So we're not just going to the beach, we're going to Beaches Resort. Yeah, no, like I said, this is a vacation. Okay. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, thanks, Rare. Oh boy, I wish I got the map for this maze, but I think I remember. This is the wrong way. We're making fun of the voice acting, but little did you know, that's Cam Clark. <laughs> that's not, I, that's like the fucking accountant down the hall or something that they got, I don't know. Uh, Almost yeah. certainly. Hey, Bob, you do that fun voice at parties. Have we got some <laughs> lines for you? Bob, how good is your burping on command? This is very important for our video game. <laughs> it's awful. You're in. Perfect. Perfect. <laughs> That's exactly what we were looking for. Bob, can you also do a weird Scottish accent? Have you been working on your Shrek impression? <laughs> We've got another role for you. No, no, I understand we could just go next door and get a Scottish guy, but... <laughs> yeah, the, the Scottish voice actor supply store is right down the street. Right. Try 
Specky, what, what on earth was that? <laughs> this little man getting PTSD <laughs> from the beach? <laughs> this is where my father died, Fox. <laughs> I forgot there's an an, an a, the, 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 there's an objective over here. Hmm. Oh look at these dudes. Oh. Come come back out. Look at them. I can't zoom in on them because when you get hit it knocks you out of this, but they're kinda cute. <laughs> they're kind of really annoying. Do you think they modeled the entire dinosaur? Uh, I doubt it. <laughs> you pay me to pass. Oh, I am not doing that. I am not paying you anything. I know how to get up here. You <laughs> fool. You complete dunce. You put a rocket pad underwater. Fuck your toll road. When I heard the sharp claw were coming to Cape Claw, I hid my precious gold deep below the sands. My memory's not what it used to be though, and now I've forgotten where I buried them. With the help of your little friend, you should be able to find them. Return all four gold bars, and I will help you on your quest. How did you know I was already on a quest? Who melted the gold into bars? <laughs> Why was the what? dinosaur <laughs> taking damage? Well, who shot the dinosaur? <laughs> oh, I think it was one of the little guys from the beach trying to shoot me, but I moved out of the oh way. Oh my god. Oh, and this guy doesn't care now, because like I broke in. He's just like, oh. He's like, well, you're in. I guess it's okay. You got your hand stamped. It's fine. <laughs> fine. Oh, fine. God damn it, Tricky. I'm at any point... Well, luckily... At any point, do we get, like, a feed bag for Tricky? <laughs> that just keeps him no. topped up? No, I have to manually hand feed him. Oh, disgusting. Oh, tricky. All right, so we got to go find this dude's gold bars, and hopefully I remember where all of them are. There's only three more. How did they mine the gold? There's a lot. There's a lot of questions. Well, when the I guess when the moon came came crashing down, it must have released all the gold into the atmosphere. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> you know, people are always releasing stuff into the atmosphere. Remember how Rob just dropped gasoline everywhere? That's true. That's true. Look how look how clever this game is. They hid a, a secret underneath of a breakable box. The fiends. Wow. Tricky, please stop paying attention to the enemy and do the thing I need you to do, okay? Good job. Yeah, there Thanks. we go. I was really hoping that was a gold bar, and it was not. Oh, here's one. <laughs> I am my own light source. This is not a gold bar, goddammit. <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> 
Oh, he died because I kicked him and he fell into the bramble. Yes, bed. beautiful. <laughs> and it did damage. Trekkie, please eat your vegetables. Thank you. See, now I'm just imagining this with the, with the red essence move set with the, uh, the insect glaive. This game would be so much better. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Diggy. Or <laughs> Tricky, Do hold your breath, Diggy. Dig. <laughs> hold your breath, Tricky. Don't breathe it in. The water, I mean. Yeah, or do. Whatever. It's, it's fine. I think that's all the gold bars. Let me see. No, it's only three of them. The uh, I think if you go back out through there, I think there's a thing. Ah, uh, there sure is. Fine. I am mashing A. Okay. All right, I got your stuff. I'm on my way back. With the help of your little friend, you should be able to find them. I forgot. I need to no, I just got. I just hand them to him. There. So if you don't get every single bar and hand him, them to him all at once, you get to watch him very slowly lay a gold bar down every single time. Oh, I can't no. wait. I'm so excited. <laughs> and all of that to knock down one ladder. Yeah. Exactly one ladder. And this one ladder will open exactly one thing. Beautiful. Oh my god, you're killing me, Rare. <laughs> Yeah, sometimes I think I'm being, like, too harsh on Rare's collect-a-thons. No. You're not. No. <laughs> no, they're... No, you're not. They're, they're just like that. <laughs> Uh-oh, a devious trap. Oh no, my fox meter's going down again. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. The little chime it plays to tell you that you put it in the right place, it just has extremely, like, flash game energy. Yeah. <laughs> well, I didn't die, uh, so that opened up a cage somehow. Alright, is everyone ready for Tricky to be racist? Whoa! A cloud runner! Shoo shoo! Go! Hey, cloud runner, get away! Uh, have you two met? He is an earthwalker. I am a cloud runner. Our tribes do not see eye to eye. His father has probably been saying bad things about me. 
Who locked you in there? General Scales. Who else? You see, I am the queen of the Cloudrunner tribe and also its gatekeeper. That guy needs to be taught a lesson. Where is he now? He used my powers to open a path to the Cloudrunner fortress. I must return there to help my tribe. I'm gonna need that spellstone. Looks like you've got yourself company, lady. Peppy, I'm returning to the Arwing. Can you make sure it's ready for takeoff? Wait a minute. There's no way I'm going up to her fortress. Okay, you can sit this one out. We'll head back to Thorntail Hollow, and you can wait there for me to return. I'll meet you at the fortress. Good luck. Do you seriously not get tricky for this part because he's being racist? <laughs> yeah, he won't go up to the uh, Cloud Runner Jesus Fortress. Jesus Christ. So you have a tricky list dungeon. Oh next. my god. Well, I mean, I guess well, it's so good that you don't have to deal with tricky. <laughs> right. <laughs> And at no point does that whole concept ever get explored. Oh no, no, of course not. This is a this is a children's game. <laughs> this is a early two thousands children's game. They are not going to dive deep into anything. Whoa! So the message here is that racism exists, but who can say if it's bad? Really, <laughs> nobody knows. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Ask an adult. But not Tricky's dad, because I think he might be racist. Right. Well, if you asked an adult yeah, if no. racism was bad in 2002, you might not get a great answer. Yeah. <laughs> you asked that in 2022, you might not get a great answer. Yeah, I was going to say, thankfully, <laughs> you know, 20 years later, we've got all that shit solved. <laughs> it might be worse now. <laughs> Oh, by the way, so I am not doing the Cloud Runner Fortress tonight because this is as far as I practiced. So we are basically done recording for today. Okay, okay. that's fair. We just have to go back to uh, Thorntail Hollow because that's just where the, I'm going to start off next. We're just wrapping up on Tricky Does a Racism. <laughs> yeah. No, I figure that's good content to fade to black to. Yeah. Yeah, good. <laughs> I think Tricky's dad is racist. Thanks for watching. Oh, Jesus. Is Tricky's dad even alive anymore? <laughs> oh, no, yeah, he's fine. We, we meet him later. <laughs> okay. Is he still racist? Uh, his racism is, is never brought up okay. again. <laughs> it's only this one time to be like, ooh, look, the, the Earth dinosaurs don't get along with the flying dinosaurs. Ooh. <laughs> and that's about as deep as it goes. Absolutely outstanding work for her. <laughs> I know, such a good game. And at this point, I literally can't go anywhere without rolling constantly because it's just ever so slightly faster. I don't blame you. <laughs> it's the right move. And if I do it right, you can chain. I'm not gonna get it. Oh, almost. I see what you were going for there, at least. Yeah. I think back when I was trying to, uh, when I was looking into, like, possibly trying to learn to speedrun this, uh, before the run turned out to be, like, five hours long at that point. Yeah. And I said, oh, no, never. <laughs> um, oh, yeah, let's try that glitch again real quick. Uh, I was playing around with the idea of chaining rolls to go faster, but it is not feasible for people to do. So this is the game that you've been trying to get me to LP with you for like eight <laughs> years, huh? Oh yeah, aren't you having a great time? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got it. Nice. First try, oh, baby. Sick. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I haven't looked up in a while, like if this trick leads to anything. I think before you used to be able to swim way out of bounds on this map and maybe start going over to the... Uh, direction we just came from oh, uh, but there was no okay. way to get it to like load the rest of the game so you could only go so far um 
and then you would just void out and the game would crash and freeze. Can mm. I get up? No! My precious orbs. Anyway, we're done. Okay. All right. <laughs> All right. We're, we're done. Stop yeah, no, recording. We, no, no, we've, <laughs> be, uh... Yeah, no, everyone can stop. You can all stop. 